Hey everyone, welcome back to another video. I am Puneet and today we're gonna check out some free tools to create your own fonts. So the first tool is called Calligrapher. Calligrapher allows you to draw on a sheet of paper some fonts or some text and that it converts that text into actual digital font. So once I'm at this quick test, what you guys need to do is click on this PDF and it opens this document right here. I want you guys to go ahead and print it. Uh, hopefully if you have a printer, that'll be great. And uh, once you've printed this document, all you need to do is fill it in just like I've done here. Um, my writing is not the best, I'm gonna be honest, but I tried the best for this video. And once I've done this, I will quickly take a quick snapshot from my mobile or just scan it with a scanner and I will upload it here. As you can see, there's a browse option if I click on here. And here is the image of this uh, document. If I click on this, say open and say generate font, uh, it will take a couple of seconds, not very long. It has very accurately created the font for me here. And I can select and copy this font here. I can increase the size to show you guys how beautiful my handwriting is, which of course it's not. And um, I can either share the font with anybody I like, or I can actually download it as an open type font or a TTF. So I can go ahead and download it. And now if I open say an Adobe XD document and I create some text here, which says, of course, my name, I'll say my name here. And uh, let me say calligrapher for that. There you go. <laughs> See, my handwriting is now on the page, just like that. Of course, if you are better at calligraphy, you'll be able to do a much better job. But uh, this has now been created. I can change it to any color I want, any shape, size. And this is a really cool tool and it's all free. So this next tool is called prototypo.io and it, uh, it does require a login. So the first step is to click on new project and it allows you to choose from a plethora of free fonts. I'll give my project a name, I'll give it my own name, and I'll say start designing. And here, as you can see, I can change the, the X height, which is how tall the font uh, is. And uh, it also allows you to change the width of the font. Uh, I can now change the thickness of the font. Uh, this is really thick. I can change the contrast of the font. Mm, high contrast looks good. That's it, you're done. Now you will be able to actually edit the font live and see how that font looks. Right now this font doesn't look really good, but uh, that is because I just randomly selected stuff. So this last font creating tool is the most advanced font creating tool as well. Uh, what, what it allows you to do is it provides an editor like Illustrator or Photoshop inside the browser. All you need to do is sign in. Once you're logged in, you can either pick from these uh, fonts that other people have created, custom fonts, or you can go to my font struct and say new font struction. And once you've done that, I want you to name it anything you want. I'm gonna name it my name so that I don't forget it. And I'll say start font structing. It allows me to pick from so many different kind of shapes, geometry, and actually create each letter one by one. And uh, this can be a slightly longer process, but well, it's the most advanced tool as well. So uh, I think it's worth it as well. Uh, now I've created A and I can keep on going here. As you can see on this toolbar, all the letters I can create from scratch and they will convert this into an actual font file. I can just go ahead and save it here. It'll save it here for me and I'll say download. It allows me to download a zip. Uh, if I open this zip up, there you go, puneet.ttf. That's my name and it's a font. Right now we only have two letters, but I'll go ahead and install it nevertheless. And uh, puneet regular, of course. Um, and I'll just say, I'll just type in AB here and I'll change this text to uh, Puneeth. And there you go. Your custom font is ready for you. I hope you liked today's video. If you did, I create such awesome content every week 
hit that subscribe button also click on that bell icon so that you get notified whenever i post new awesome content i'll see you next week goodbye and god bless